With a higher focus on material recycling and the increasing technology used in lamps today, it's important with separation of the various fractions when handling lamp waste. The MRT lamp processor makes it possible to ensure the reuse of valuable fractions in an environmentally friendly way. CFLs and pre-crushed lamps are inserted into the feeding station. Fluorescent lamps are inserted at the top. All of the materials get crushed and then transported to the drum sieve. Glass, fluorescent powder and conductive fractions get separated in the drum sieve. The toxic fluorescent powder is transported through a vacuum to the ventilation system across the MRT LP in each stage. The valuable non-glass materials are shredded again and transported to be further sorted into conductive, non-conductive, and mixed conductive fractions by an electrostatic separator. The materials are later collected in separate bins. The rest from glass and fluorescent powder are filtered in the tumbler. Glass fractions are transported and collected in a big bag at the end. Through a dry process in the air treatment unit, the fluorescent powder is separated from the air in three stages. The first stage is a cyclone that separates most of the larger particles containing most of the mercury. The second stage separates smaller particles in the air with a particle filter. And in the last stage, the free airborne mercury is safely filtered through eight active carbon filters, leaving only clean air. Using the LP provides you with a minimum of 85% recyclable material and renders the highest output value regardless of the mix of lamps. For Returnity.